This past weekend, I went to Stanford Tree Hacks, the largest collegiate hackathon in the US. This is a story of how I pulled my first 36 hour long all nighter and how my team built a robot from scratch and won a grand prize. Yeah, we're definitely not sleeping tonight. Like that's not even a question. We're gonna put on the linear rails now. This is the basis for our robot. It's currently 5.30 a.m. Wait, why is it corrupted? Huh? Uh, why did the IMU crash? Oh my God, we get a chicken tender from late night. February 13th and I'm about to fly out for Tree Hacks. It's currently 12.30 and I'm in my dorm. Um, I'm about to take the train down to Grand Central and from there I'm gonna meet up with my friend Alex and his friend Neil. We're gonna head over to the airport, JFK, and we're gonna fly to SF. It's gonna be a great hackathon. I'm looking forward to this. If it feels anything like it was last year, it's gonna be one of the best experiences of my life. So, get ready, I'm about to go. Yo. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Are we waiting for the We're train? in Jamaica. <laughs> <laughs> Jamaica me late. Alright, we made it onto the plane. Oh my god. What's up? What's up? Welcome back, Zim. Welcome back, Zim. We're about to head back to our respective homes. That's right. Sleep in our own beds. Yep. Hell yeah. Type shit. And then tomorrow is is the first day of Tree Hacks. It is currently um, February 14th, Valentine's Day, and I'm about to go to a hackathon lunch. Um, this is a General Catalyst Venture Fellows lunch that Robert got me to sign up for. I'm not really sure what to expect, but um, I think it'll be a good chance to meet other people. All right, guys, we are here at Tresseter. I'm with my boy, Robert Zhang, and uh, we're about to go to the General Catalyst Venture Fellows Lunch. All right, we're at the, uh, the General Catalyst uh, Venture, Venture Fellows Lunch, and um, we're just like now we're getting shit right now. Uh, these are some people that we met. Pretty sick of that. All right, guys, we're going to Apple Park right now to uh, explore. I have these two at the, um, the lunch. Yes. And, uh, yeah. Also, like, the Apple Store. We're at Apple Park right now. Gave me some sick AR glasses that I'm about to try on. Hold on. What do I look like? Oh my god, bro. I gotta start working on the library with these on. How much were these? So we got back from Apple Park and now we're walking to the Huang Engineering Building where we're gonna check in. So I think that would be interesting because the data science building is for. <laughs> oh, Chris, the co director oh, this year. Good to see you, my boy. You look like an Arjun? Yeah. 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 We're about to get registered for Tree Hacks. We got the sponsor booths now. Okay, right. All right, we're currently at the sponsors, uh, sponsor section of the, the hackathon. So there's a lot of booths set up here, and we're just going around talking to different sponsors and scanning QR codes and stuff. Just help Chris move some Pokari sweats. We're on the way to go get dinner with Michelle and uh, Alex right now. Look at that. Look at that camera. I am uh, outside the Oval right now. Stanford's Oval. 
heading over to meet up with my team right now. Looks like this is where we'll be hacking. This is the data science building. It's gonna be pretty. I think we're gonna be spending a lot of time here. Wait, did you change? Or are we always wearing that? All right, this is our hacking venue. We're set up in the in the um, data science building right now. We have quite the collection of supplies here, and we're about to head over to the hardware hardware lab to get started at 9, 9 p.m. It can get out of hand otherwise. Damn. Uh, we're about to get to into the hardware lab. So, uh, th this lab right here. We just had a snack run. Got the pure protein bars, and we got the vitamin water. And we got the Pokari sweats, and we're ready to lock in now. I'm planning to sleep at least like four hours, maybe. Is that the or something like this? Yeah, I Exit sign is installed backward, and we got this entrance to the building. Ten forty-six p.m. and uh, we're about to assemble the linear rails. We've been working uh, since nine, pretty much, to get the chassis sort of built here. We're gonna put on the linear rails now. This is the basis for our robot. Oh, I don't think I ever broke down what we're making. Hold on. Okay, so our project, because I forgot to mention it, we're building a robot that can get food for you. It's pretty much like a. But we're pretty much making a robot um, that can move around and has like a six degree of freedom stylus arm that can go ahead and like input stuff. And the idea is like we say we put in a one sentence natural language input like get me food from late night, and this robot can go and get food for you from like whatever place like on campus. So. This is the basis for it. We're building the body right now. And then a lot of the brain stuff is gonna come later when we start coding it out. But we have the chassis getting assembled, linear rails getting put on. And then on top of the linear rail, we're gonna put the slider with the stylus and the um, horizontal movement, six degrees of freedom type shit. Yeah. Back to the time lapse. Nano has uh, booted on our projector, and uh, we're also attaching the linear rails right now. Day one of hacking complete. It's currently 5 a.m. and um, I'm about to head back home, take a shower and go to sleep for about maybe like three to four hours and then come back and do the coding. Yeah. But yeah, I think that was a pretty productive session. We got our robot like mostly up and running. I think I'm recording. Um, this guy is Chop Chin. Robert Ian says hi. Um, tell Ian she has Chop Chin. What the fuck? Nah, tell her I say hi, <laughs> hello. It's currently uh, around 11.30 a.m. I have fully woken up, gotten ready and everything. Um, I got a good like five hours of sleep, so I'm feeling pretty solid. I'm about to head over to <clears throat> Stanford campus again, head back to the room and just get to code in today. We have about 21 hours left in the competition and I think that most of the robots should be pretty much done by this point and uh, we can start testing the code out and like driving it around. I hope I get to sleep tonight. There is a chance that I won't though. Um, tomorrow we'll be judging uh, at 9 a.m. That's when the project is due. Then 10 to 12 is judging. And then we have the closing ceremony and then by 5 p.m. everything will be finished and I'll be asleep in my bed, hopefully. So we had a stroke of genius. We're naming our robot Omnom. Like the guy from Cut the Rope. And we're gonna dangle the food from a from a rope on the robot, and we gotta cut the rope to get the food. We're all not maxing. <laughs> this this might this might be the differentiating factor. I 
it's currently 5 p.m. And we right, are going to the software side. The robot has moved a little like, bit so far, but yeah, no, there's some yeah. issues. So I'm currently working on the web the side of things. I'm working on just an interface to take in the order and then generate a list of waypoints to send to our robot. Robert's currently working on the sensor fusion stuff. Cut the... Barrel jack? Yeah. I'll just say, okay, we did that. <laughs> we did it, sorry, it didn't have time. <laughs> okay, then we'll just have to tune Wait, wait, no, I don't think like, it's trying to tune right now. Like, right now it's doing auto-tune. Bob's been putting it in work. Look at this. Uh, wait, the like, object detection, so the, the, running boxes, disparity map. Can... Oh, this is great. Nice. All right. Now we okay, just the lift is working. Oh, I see. Wait, was it? I saw it driving outside for a second. Is it working? We at least have it, the drive moving, and we, yeah. we can do enough. So the next step is we need to get an IMU for the driving solved, I guess. Did I, did I All right, it's currently around eight o'clock, and I'm on the way to grab dinner with Robert, our first meal of the day. But yeah, progress-wise, we're making good work. It was driving a little bit, but we still have a lot to do. I don't know where he is. Yeah. Oh, what? <laughs> Um, so we only, we don't have any meat options left, uh, but we have, at all? Um, lots, oh, turkey. Of, lots of great turkey wins, yeah. Okay, that's fine. Oh, it's vegan turkey. Yeah. Oh, word, okay. Okay, thank you. Oh, I think we're good on that, yeah. <laughs> can we get some snacks too? Let's see, can I identify Robert's burrito? Wait, let me get out of the frame. No, 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 it's fine. Toothbrush? What does that say? He thinks the straw's a toothbrush. I think this is a sandwich. That's Keep actually pretty good. That's pretty good. What if I hold it up like this? Does it know it's like a drink? Yeah, it's a cup. I mean, that's the closest thing. Wait, that's pretty good. Well, it's not bad. 27 a.m. The project is due in six hours. And we're trying to integrate the... We're trying to bring the code in right now. Wait, the hardware. Ever, like... Just coming together. All right, what's up, guys? It's currently 4.19 a.m. Nails and Arjun are outside testing out the bot. Um, trying to get the sensors fully working. And then around four hours until submission is due. We still haven't made the video or anything, um, so I think we're like a little bit on a time crunch right now. Bruh, I think, yeah, we're definitely not sleeping tonight, like that's not even a question. Um, we're definitely gonna all-nighter till, till 9. It's moving. Yeah, it, it uh, crashed. Uh, it's currently 5.30 a.m. and uh, we're about to go film our demo video. This is the final stretch here. Over under. Over uh, under it makes it 1% of the way to late night. <laughs> over under correct direction. <laughs> I think it'll I think it'll go the right way. Okay. Is there a reason why we have to run on your laptop? Like the phone like that? Alright, just so I can test. Oh, is it easier? Otherwise like I'm like like the thing is literally gonna try the first time like when we get downstairs. Alright, you sure? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we'll see. Get outside. Illuminate the side of the channel. Wait, why is it corrupted? Huh? Oh my god, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I'll just reclaim the repo. But, oh my god. Uh, wait, how is this a thing? How does it get corrupted like this? Wait, this is kind of annoying because then I have to like re-download all the virtual environment and stuff. Get the nano requirements. Oh fuck, I don't fucking know what requirements to get. Okay, well, we're gonna have to be downloading some dependencies, guys, sorry. Okay. Uh, okay. uh why did the IMU crash? Oh my god. Okay, well, the IMU crashed, so that's why now we just restart it. Too late night, guys. Okay, ready? Ready? Get, get up close, get up close. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Feed the screen, feed the screen, feed the screen. Okay. I want to get a chicken tender from late night. Oh my god! Wait! Alright, luckily the robot actually moved. Let's go! The fucking is messing up! Okay, we're gonna 
go ahead and finish the rest of the demo video, which is the indoor part, 7 a.m. right now. I just pretty much finished editing the video and um, I'm gonna head back up to meet up with my team. Judging hacking ends in about 30 minutes. We have two minutes left. What the um, fuck? It's just, wait, is it 17 more minutes? Oh yeah, they, they already extended that shit. So I gotta do that all, yeah, they all just again. Oh, wait, okay, delete all the sponsors, so let's go again, let's go again. <laughs> um, Sorry. We just submitted our dev post. Hacking is officially over in two minutes, they extended it by 15 minutes. Oh my god. Yeah, good job, guys. The judging now, it's currently 10.30, they push back judging. It's starting now though, so we're gonna head over with the robot. Yeah, I'm off, we're both off zero sleep, all four of us. Um, didn't sleep last night. And uh, I feel like my heart is gonna, like, I feel like I'm at a heart, heart attack, bro. We're heading over to the aura farming right now. You see the reactions? You good? All right, guys. We set up at the booth right now. This is our booth 177. Here's our robot. But yeah, it's gonna be a good judging session, I believe. where more of the custom stuff pops in and so like because this is like on a three quarter inch little pattern it becomes pretty easy to know what dimension to use you can see here we actually did a lot of rework on this piece on the other side yeah um you'll look you'll see there's extra holes here yeah, yeah, and there's yeah. slotted holes that i did with by hand on like a hand drill over a trash can like <laughs> love to see it. i love to see it all right alex bro i'm eating how was <laughs> How was, react, how was your React 2025 experience? It was fun, it was fun. It was much more chill than last year. I realized I need to go home to sleep, which is fun. Yeah. Built a cool product. We're getting lunch and uh... This um guy's also getting lunch. Um is about to grab a burrito for us too. Okay. Judging and now we're getting lunch. I think it was a good session. We had like hella, hella, hella yapping. Thanks to this beta for carrying our, our robot. He's got to the opportunity to aura farm. Aura oh, farm? No, it, it is aura farming. People stop, they look at the robot, and they're like, damn, what the fuck is that? Yeah, like that. Walk into the closing ceremony right now. So then overall, the school is rated pretty badly because it's going to be delayed yeah. it by 15 minutes. Do they really? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, what's up? Hey, it's good. Can you I can just keep your laptop and like... I apologize again for all the delays and technical difficulties, but we made it, so let's give us a round of applause. <laughs> and I'm Krish, and I'm the sponsorship director. Thank you guys so much again for traveling, and yeah, we just want to give a round of applause to all the hackers who have won. Congratulations. So, and we have most creative, Pretty cool. Goes to Omnam. Go. Where's that? Oh, should I try? Next, we have the most. We have. Hot Watch. <laughs> Alright, guys, we just won most creative hack at Tree Hacks. <laughs> I'm a two time most creative hack winner. This guy's Undefeated at that shit. <laughs> Alright, that wraps up Tree Hacks. I'm very happy to have won something. I think we get DJ Ports. <laughs> Classic Krish money, our prize. <laughs> yeah! Creative hack. Tree Hacks, bro. This is a top six prize, bro. Actually, though. Actually, I can't even tell if I'm happy with like, the award. I'm just not happy with like, what we did. I don't see no, so proud of what we did. No, it's crazy like, that we did that. <laughs> no, I remember when I drilled. Alright, guys. That is, this is the last vlog entry for Tree Hacks. Um, we had a good run. We, good we won Most Creative, so I think it was pretty successful. We got our DJ sets. Like, yes. we're gonna start Ooh, making yeah. music. <laughs> this is good. But yeah, 